right, everybody. Thanks for being on time this morning. Let's get set up so we can start. This morning, we're gonna start with a monkey see, monkey do, rubber dam exercise. But first, let's keep the end in mind. I want you guys to burn this image into your synapses for the rest of your careers. Look at this beautifully placed rubber dam, how it contours the teeth beautifully. The seal is beautiful here, interproximally. Look at the inversion, we're gonna see that. Most restorative materials will work better and last longer if they are placed in the mount in a dry environment. Unfortunately, the mount is a wet environment. Enamel and dentin, same animal, but two very different beasts. But in enamel we trust because enamel is predictable. So this morning's exercise, we need to complete six MODLs uh, with the amalgam restorations. At 12.30, for those that are staying, we're gonna have a class five DV extension club. And if you have extra time, we're gonna have three MODBLs to do with their amalgam restorations. Know that you are on a learning curve. Do not be disappointed when we send you back to do it again. Do not accept mediocrity. In The Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell, he states that you need to be willing to put in your 10,000 hours of intense training to achieve exceptional work to master any skill. Your 10,000 hours of your 10,000 hours of your 10,000 hours. That's the 10,000 hours and 10,000 more. Oh, if that's what it takes to learn to drill this class to us. And it might never get there, but I'm gonna try. If it's 10,000 hours or the rest of my life, I'm gonna drill more. Ooh. Finally, the recording for tomorrow morning is posted. Okay guys, so when you adjust the wax rim, you have to pay particular attention to the vertical dimension of the face. And for this, we usually consider video and DVR. But most importantly, it's a facial movement. The patient is doing while doing this, you have to pay attention. Can I please have some help with my dentures, Dr. Batista? Is this a maxilla? Uh, yeah, sure. It's not bad, but it's not perfect.
lazy. I reverse her over now. One day, I lost all my diamond burrs, so I went into Linda's office and took a whole set of them. Yeah, I still don't know the difference between the two stones. I just mix the two together, and when the color is good, I just pour. Worked for me so far. I drill table top when the demos are not looking. I will try to do the same to the patients. Remember when we dropped our dentures and they cracked in half? I linked the super glued them back together. Yeah.